So it's important to understand that technology, even artificial intelligence, is not a magic wand, and I'm not Hermione Granger. If you are hoping that technology will magically solve your problems for you, then you won't be able to make a change inside your organization. What it can do is take solutions you already know work and transform their economics. If you know that what you truly need are resilient employees, you can't read that off of a resume. You can't see that from a university degree. But I've had the pleasure of being able to build machine learning systems that could actually mine through the actual evidence of resilience in people's lives, just from their public personal profiles. Being able to do that, being able to see someone more deeply, not less, is the amazing potential of technology to transform inclusion in our companies and in society. If I had three pieces of advice for organizations looking to become more inclusive, uh, I'm gonna focus on the big picture. The first and most crucial is to be brutally honest with yourself. Does our organization truly embrace the value of diversity or is this cultural change? The research is very clear that companies that don't currently have a value of diversity and inclusion do not benefit from traditional uh, DNI practices. And in that case, you need to approach this as a cultural change problem. My second piece of advice is understand that culture is an ecosystem. You cannot look at one single part of an organization's journey into being more inclusive and think that that will solve the entire problem. In our research, for example, we find amazingly brilliant and talented young women joining companies and working incredibly hard only to leave because they looked up and saw no one like themselves in a position of power. And in the back of their heads, they thought, why am I working so hard if it's never going to pay off? If you can't look at how you make the entire organization from top to bottom inclusive, then you can't solve any of the individual steps along the way. And the last is to recognize that technology can play a role in this process. Technology can be a transformative tool, but it can't solve your problem for you. If you don't know how to bring real value into your organization, if you can't recognize people for who they are, technology won't figure it out for you. Figure out the practices that work. Um, maybe they're more expensive than your company is willing to invest in. But this is where artificial intelligence and technology can play a role. This is where they can be a transformative system for changing the economics of those solutions. Maybe rather than having to bring in thousands and thousands of candidates to fill certain types of roles within your organization, you can begin to recognize the unique qualities of people uh, in an active way going out and discovering people that would never even have applied for a role. That's the power of technology, is to take what you wish you could do and make it happen, not to sit back and let it do some amazing magic for you.